Hello, I'm Steve Sinetti, President and CEO of the National Shooting Sports Foundation, the trade association for the firearms industry. Today, the United States Supreme Court ruled that the Second Amendment is a fundamental right that must be respected by state and local governments. This ruling is a victory for freedom and liberty. Now, all law-abiding citizens, whether they live in a big city like Chicago or in rural Wyoming, have the same American right to keep and bear arms. The case, McDonnell versus the city of Chicago, extended the court's 2008 Heller decision, which reaffirmed that the Second Amendment protects an individual right to keep and bear arms to state and local governments. The Supreme Court declared the right to keep and bear arms is a fundamental right and compared it to the First Amendment. This means that the Second Amendment is now in the category of rights that receives the utmost level of protection from government interference. Specifically, the court stated, quote, it is clear that the framers and ratifiers of the 14th Amendment counted the right to keep and bear arms among those fundamental rights necessary to our system of ordered liberty, close quote. This is indeed a great day for all law-abiding firearms owners and for those citizens considering becoming firearms owners, especially in cities which have virtually prohibited lawful firearms ownership. The Supreme Court has made clear that the constitutional rights of law-abiding Americans do not stop at state and city borders.